Hello, hello. Welcome back. How are you? Hello, hello. Welcome, Blanca. Welcome, Axel. How are you today? Hello, I'm fine. Thank you. Did you enjoy the weather yesterday? Mm, no, there is a, it was a, a bit hot in my home. Where do you live? There's no, in, I live in Mexicano. Ah, okay. Did you have electricity? Um, I, I have had I I had electricity on my home yesterday, oh. but in other in other places they didn't. Yeah, I didn't have electricity in my house. Well, it it was a time to rest. Yes, yes, <laughs> and also there was a a thunderstorm. A uh, terrible, terrible thunderstorm. I I can see uh, today at morning in near to the Cusco Clan Stadium. It, it seems like it's so wet, but I can remember if yesterday it, it could rain. I. I didn't notice. Oh, yes. Um, yesterday here, it was storming like crazy. It was storming like out of control. But here in Mexicano, there's no, there was no rain. Oh, there was no rain? No. Oh, okay. 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 Awesome. All right, guys, welcome everybody. Hello, Manuel de Jesus. Welcome, Blanca. Welcome, Andres. Welcome, Thank Freddy. You. Welcome, Justin Lynn. Welcome, welcome. Today, I would like for us to get started with a conversation activity. Repeat after me. If you had one wish, what would it be? If you had one wish, what would you be? If you were rich, what would you do? If you were rich, what would you do? If you could be a celebrity for a day, which celebrity would you be? If you were a celebrity for a day, which celebrity would you be? If you were the principal at school, what would you change? If you were the principal at school, what would you change? If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? If you could be any animal for a day, what would it be and why? You should be any animal for today. What would it be and why? If you could go, oh, no, sorry. If you could have any superpower, what would you pick and why? If you could uh, have, you have any superpower, any superpower would you pick what would you pick and why? If you could pack only three items for your next trip, what would they be? If you could you pack could only three, three items, items for your, for next, your next, trip, next trip, what would they be? If you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? If you could change you one could thing change about, one yourself, about yourself, what would it be? What would it be? What, no, it would be? If you could travel to the moon, would you like to go? If, if you, you could travel, travel to the moon, to the moon would, you like to go? would you like to go? 
if you win the lottery, what is the first thing you would do? If you win the lottery, what is the first thing you would do? La Costa del Sol. La Ola Betos and a big fish. <laughs> That's the first thing I would do. <laughs> uh, if they could pick a Halloween costume. Uh, here's a mistake. If you could pick a Halloween costume. If you could be a Halloween costume. To dress up. To dress up on Halloween. On Halloween. What would it be? What, what would, would it be? Batman. I would be Batman. Batman. <laughs> okay. Does anybody have any questions? about the vocabulary in the questions? I don't have any questions. Okay. So I'm going to share the questions with you. I'm going to put them on the chat for the Zoom. Does everybody have it? Do you have it? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, yes. please, please read the questions. And if you have any questions about the pronunciation, if you have a question related to a word, a vocabulary word, please ask me. Okay. Does everybody have the questions? Yes. yes. Are you yes. Are you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay. Let me have one volunteer. One volunteer to ask me the question. Me, teacher? All right, David. David, ask me the question. Whatever question, okay. whatever the question. You select the question. Whatever. No, question. Not all of them? No, no, no. Not all, all of them? Oh, only you're, one. You're going to select only two or three. That's it, because we need to continue. All right. Well, the first one. Yeah. If, if you were rich, what would you do? If I would rich, I would, first thing that I would do is open a fund for an orphanage so that all the, the kids, the children that their moms or their fathers abandon them because they go to the United States or they immigrate to another country and they don't have opportunities for education, for athletics, for entertainment, for clothes, for food, uh, then I would take care of those children that have been abandoned, giving them medical uh, attention if they are sick, uh, providing them with the tools necessary for them to progress in their life and become honorable citizens of society. That's the first thing, establish that. Uh, number two, I would open a center for widowed women. Women that, right. you know, their husband died. Maybe their husband was working and he died, or maybe he got sick, uh, COVID, and he died. And these women can go to these centers and they can receive uh, education, they can receive conferences, they can receive financial assistance so that they can open a little business or a way for them to invest so that they can receive a passive income. 
you know, because there are a lot of women in that situation. I think that those would probably uh, also uh, I would open a center for men, for senior citizen men, men that, you know, all their life they worked. You know, they trusted the system. They trusted that the system was going to take care of them at an, at a, at an advanced age. However, you and I both know that does not exist, right? These people, if their family doesn't take care of them, then they're stuck out. So I would establish a, a government, uh, a fund, a foundation uh, where people can donate, you know, super selectos, uh, the Spencer de Don Juan, whatever, that they can donate to get a tax write-off. And we would use this foundation and these funds to help these men in need, men that have depression, men that are lost in alcoholism and drug abuse, try to help them rehabilitate. If they don't know any type of skills like mechanics, carpentry, electricity, plumbing, whatever, that can keep them entertained and motivated, you know, give them, uh, take them out, take them to the, to the beach, uh, maybe take them to the mountains, give them spiritual retreat, uh, you know, so that they don't feel alone, so that they can have some type of support, family support, even though we are not family, but for them to feel like they are in a family. Okay, nice, nice uh -huh. things. There, is, there are nothing that kill people like loneliness. That's right. Loneliness kill people, yes. That's right. The second question. The second question. If you... If you could be born at a different time period, what would it be? <laughs> <laughs> this is a good question. <laughs> I knew you were going to ask that question. If I could be born at a different time frame, which would it be? I would say the future. Um, I would say when contamination doesn't exist, uh, a future where people are evolved, no, no envy, no hate, no violence. Um, I would love to live in a utopian society where everything is free. Uh, if you wanna buy a Tesla, I can buy a Tesla too. You know, if you want to live in Malibu, California, I can live in Malibu, California, too. You know, I would love to live in a period. I know that it's going to happen because it, it's happening right now. You know, we see it with all this new technology being invented, uh, emission, no emission fuels. You know, you have electric cars everywhere. Uh, so that's the future. That's that's what's happening. You know, we we are living the transition of, of this era, the industrial area, right? The contaminating area, the petrodollar, the oil, right? We're leaving this era. This era is, is becoming obsolete little by little, day by day, year by year. Technology is advancing so much that we are, we, cars don't even have emission fuels anymore. You look at all these cars that they're inventing in Japan, in Europe, in Spain, they have no emission fuels. So it's a big movement towards that. And technology, cryptocurrency, and all these uh, advances that humankind has made is going to permit that to happen. However, there are still things in place that need to be broken down, structures of society that need to be pulled out in order for these changes to take place. But I am motivated. I am positive. I am looking forward to that time because I know that it's going to come. So if I could choose a, a different time frame to live in, it would be in the future at that time where contamination doesn't exist, crime doesn't exist, uh, you know, people love each other, people help each other, people support each other. That's, that's the time that I would like to live in, but it still hasn't happened, but it's coming. One more? Or? I think that's enough. Does everybody get the idea? Enough. Okay. Does everybody get the idea? Yes. Okay. Do you have any questions? No, teacher. 
Okay, who can tell me what are you going to do? Who can tell me what are you going to do? We are going to ask to one of our partner one of the questions. We are going to select one. He must explain what he will do. That's right. It depends on the question that we will ask him or he, to him or her. That's the correct. The way you did before. Very good. And what is the objective of this activity? Conversation development, pronunciation development, fluency development, talking, speaking, practice, practice, practice. Do you understand? Yes. Are you ready? I said, I said, Maybe. are you ready? Yes, sir. All right, all right. Everybody get your favorite drink, your water, your juice, your Coca-Cola, whatever your favorite drink is, get comfortable and get ready to talk, 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 talk. Okay. All right. See, we're gonna have here David. David, good. Okay, and let's go. Mute. Okay, hello, Fernando. How are you? Does everybody have the questions? Hello. Yes, teacher, we have it. Do me a favor, share the questions in the WhatsApp group, please. Okay, teacher. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Fernando, are you there? Yes, I am. Okay, you got the questions? Uh, no, I don't have it. <laughs> You don't have it, I, I will put in the chat so you can copy them. Okay, thank you. In the chat of the Zoom and then in the chat of the of the WhatsApp. But first of all, in the chat of Zoom. Okay. You can copy. Now I will put it in the chat of the WhatsApp. Okay, I have it. Okay, you got it? Yes. What's up? But I saw Telma too. I don't know if it's still there. No. Okay. That's only you and me. Okay. Okay. What do you want? I ask you, or you ask me first one. The first one on one. You ask me one. I ask you one. You first. Okay, do you start or are you start? Do you, you start? Do you have any questions? No, teacher, we are okay. Okay, we are starting now the activity. Okay, okay, Fernando, this is my my first question. Okay. Is if you could be a celebrity for a day, which celebrity would you be? Okay, maybe it's easy for me. I, I like so much uh, soccer and I I would be a, a famous soccer player like, I don't know, Cristiano Ronaldo. Excellent. And, 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 and why would you like to be a, a, a celebrity like that? It's obvious. <laughs> He's the ah. best. <laughs> He's the best. Well, in the first, in the yes, first place, yes. maybe maybe the the, the 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 behavior of Cristiano Ronaldo. I don't like the behavior, but he is an excellent player. And I I am uh, 
I like Real Madrid and I remember all that Ronaldo uh, did for Real Madrid. Uh, that was awesome and maybe that is the maybe the main the main reason that I would like to be Cristiano Ronaldo for a day. Excellent, excellent. I don't follow much the the soccer. Uh, I like to see part of a of a match, but not all the match. It, yes, the, the soccer like me, but uh, I don't waste my time saying a, a whole game. But uh, I I I knew about uh, African guy. I I didn't know the name that uh, with her incomes. He opened schools, he opened mm. orphans, he opens, uh, I don't know, stadiums, or something mm. like that. Uh, I don't it, know the name. Maybe it's Sadio Mane? Uh, maybe, maybe, yes. Yes, excellent. Th that guy is, is uh, amazing, I think. But, yes. Okay, <laughs> but it's it, it your wish and... and, and and you, you have all the right to be whatever you want to be. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, Fernando, ask me the question. Okay. Uh, if you win the, lot, the lottery, what is the first thing that you would do? Okay, this is a difficult question because uh, according to all of the statistical, uh, the 99 or 98% of the people who, who wins the lottery in three or five years, in three or five years, they'll, they, uh, they come back to the position that they have before uh, winning, yes, the lottery, yes. winning the lottery or even worse, even worse. And in that case, uh, the, the first thing will be make a plan make a plan and uh, uh, do investment, look for uh, passive incomes, uh, look for, because the, the first thing that we, we think uh, is to spend the money. Is the yes. first thing, <laughs> spend the money, yes. Uh, buy, buy and buy and, and uh, the money go away. And the first thing is to make the plan, uh, he look for passive incomes and and to capitalize the, the 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 money to do some investment and to make the money endure for more time and use it in in a, a wise way. I think that that will be. Yes, you you are right. Maybe. Uh, all the people, the first thing that they did is did that they do is spend the money. Uh, well, in my case, uh, I would like first pay my or my my debt, and after that maybe I I can do uh, maybe a a business or or something that I I can uh, I can transfer that money in a on a passive income like you you said or. Uh, maybe. I like, I like it. I like it. I like the way you think. I like the way you think. Yeah. <laughs> yes, because it's, it's, it's difficult for, for, to maintain the money. It's just only spend it, spend it, spend it. Works. Okay. Mm -hmm. The person have a, a words that the lottery in the United States. Uh, actually, he he be, um, he is changing several things in my downs, in my in my, my pueblo downs. Oh no, town, town, You're right. yeah. town, town, town is correct. Mm -hmm. Hometown, your hometown. Yeah, in my hometown. Okay. Well, if we can could choose another question. Mm. If you were God, uh -huh. 
Charlie. You were going uh, into a, a Halloween party. What would you like to dress it? Um, What's your favorite favorite um, superhero or El Diadande? What? I'm sorry? El Diadán. Mm, I don't know about Cuando te dicen el, el, el disfraz de Adán. Ah, ok. You're a, a nude. <laughs> It's a joke. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> ok. <laughs> The Tarzan. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, yes. Just, uh, just wearing a... Um, how do you say oh, hoja is leaf is like leaf okay, okay okay just one leaf of the of the middle of your body oh, okay <laughs> <laughs> okay mm. what about you Yoselin? We lose it. We yeah. lose her. You are there, Jocelyn. We lose her. Yeah, maybe no. The second question or the yeah, next. I I can remember something about if you could pick three items um, for uh For start to for start a journey, what would you pick up? Just just only three items. Uh -huh. Only three items. Mm. I don't know. <sighs> But how do you what, ever what, see? whatever things? When whatever things yes, it's it's something similar to uh, I would, I would like to pick up the the knowledge. The knowledge. Yeah. I don't know. If, I don't know if this correct for sabiduría. Yes. Yes. Ah, okay. Yes, wisdom, knowledge. Um, another one. Oh. I would. Uh -huh. I would like to pick. Um, um. I would like to pick. Um. Well. Uh, I don't know what how to translate and send the door like fire light light lighting lighter a lighter because no one could start a journey without fire. Wow. Yes, <laughs> a light. Okay. Um, I would like to be. Um, Mm. Mm. Maybe a notebook and a pencil. And a pencil. Why yes. a pencil? Mm. Because I need the notebook to write something. And, ah, okay. And I will need to use a pencil too. Yes. Okay. Okay. And maybe, and maybe some uh, clothes. To work. Okay. Cool. <laughs> yes. There are my three items there. Yes. 
Well, you mm. can, would you like to ask another question? Yeah. Uh, okay. Right now I, I am, I am checking the, the text that the teacher sent to the group. Uh, okay. Ah, okay, you know, this is, if you could be any animal for a day, what would you, what would it be and why? Mm. I would like to not cars, no cars, no technology, yeah. no uh, technology advances, medicine. You will be a, a, a richer guy, a, a rich guy if you, <laughs> if you invent all of the all of the things that we know at this time or you will you 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 have been trained like a wizard or or a we no, which no but a wizard or something like that and you will be you sorry <laughs> and and it will they will treat you like uh, I don't know something like like the church kill the people that think different at this at uh, that time they kill the the people they yes. if you if you know too much <laughs> and you say something like the earth was <sighs> I don't know how to say. A circle, but in another word. Okay. <laughs> I, I forget. Okay. okay, we can change the the question. <laughs> okay. Uh, If you could travel to the moon, would you like to go? To the moon? Yes. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, me neither. Because it, it, it's something that I don't want to do. But if I could and it was for free, and it, it could be for free. Well, welcome. <laughs> it's a new experience. It will be a, a new experience. I, I had mixed feelings because I, I don't know, it will be excited and wow, so excited to be in the moon and see our planet. But <laughs> the journey to get there. <laughs> It should be awful, scary. Uh, and I have, uh, I have, uh, imagine if you can come back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when you are at the, at the moon and you see uh, a rock or a, a meteorite <laughs> crashing oh. to the planet. So? Life in another planet. Mm. Another one. If you could be uh, any animal for a day, what would it be and why? Uh -huh. I would like to be a, a little. Sorry. I would like to. I uh, would like to be an eagle. Oh. So you can fly. You can fly, <laughs> you can fly too. 
and they uh, the eagle has a una buena vista como se dice what una buena vista tienen la tengo entendido que tienen una buena visión yeah Ah, a good vision. A good sight. So vision. Mm -hmm. vision. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but they, they had. They have a good vision. I'm going to see vision. <laughs> mm, well, I, I would like to be a, a tiger. I love tigers. Or, or maybe a cat. <laughs> they can sleep all day and nobody bothers them. So I would like to be a cat, to sleep all day. <laughs> this is for sleep all day. Yeah, <laughs> only for that. Okay. And you, Doris? Yeah, I would like to be a eagle too. Okay. Yes. It's a, the eagle is free. It's free. It's a, a good, uh, I don't know. Fly. Ah, good, good. Fly. Flyer. Uh, flyer. Mm -hmm. In, is this a, a smart? The, this animal is smart, very smart. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. They are. And you, Fatima? I think I would like to be a cat too. <laughs> yeah, that's good. They only sleep, eat, and sleep, sleep again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they have they have a, an easy life. <laughs> okay. Doris, yeah. ask, ask um, another question. I don't know if you if you have the question. There are yeah. there is on the chat. There are on the chat. Okay. Um, let me see. If you win the lottery, what is the first thing you would do? The first thing I would do? Mm, yes. It's to buy to my mother a house, a big house. Oh. That's, That's the first thing. Me I too. Do. <laughs> I, I, I buy a, I buy a, a big, big house for me. But <laughs> that, is, that is because my family it's a it's a I have a big family so in that house could be we could be together so I, that's good. I I drink I always drink with a kitchen bigger kitchen yeah it would be amazing like uh, in the films the a uh, kitchen with a big freezer, big stove, big, uh, I don't know. Pantries? <laughs> I don't know how, how we call it in, in English, but. Yeah, yes. Yeah, I know what it's, the, what it's looked like in my dream. <laughs> in <Yes>. my dream. <laughs> a big garden. Yeah. With many, uh, yes, maybe the same thing. Change my house and have a, a big house. Big house, big rings. 
beat car. And you, Fatima? Um, sure. One of the first things that I would like to do is to buy a piece of land uh, in, at the beach and build uh -huh. a house there. Oh. Okay, but if the money it's if the if we win the lottery the lottery but it's a a, a low a low price that it will be sad <laughs> because we we are dreaming too high but <laughs> <laughs> Because my mom, it's already uh, won the lottery, but she she won five dollars, twenty dollars. <laughs> so <laughs> we're assuming that it's a a, a, a big amount. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay, I'm next. I'm next. Uh, if you could pick a Halloween costume to dress up as on Halloween, what will it be? A Halloween? Halloween yes. costume. If you could pick a, a Halloween costume, what will um. it be? Ah, I love anime, so <laughs> I want to be a, an anime character. I like to be uh, I like to be a witch. A witch. Yes. I would. I would like to be a cactus. Cactus. Yeah, cactus. Why? Or, oh, no, 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 I know, I know. I would like to be um, a plant uh, called uh, Rosario. It's a, 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 a plant that the, its leaves are circles. It is really beautiful. I would like to dress up like that. Like a plant. Like yeah. a rosario plant. Yes. I'm going to search and on on Google. Um, okay. Is it's beautiful? Yeah, it is. I saw a costume in and on Instagram. Really? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Maybe I will be a, a, a character, a anime, an anime character. Because I love that. Maybe Sakura, Star Captors. Okay. Okay. Other question. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you where would you go and why? I would like to go to Venezia. Venezia. Uh -huh. I would like yeah, because it's a, it's an amazing place. All the the, the water. There's no streets, only water. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. and, and they and it is there there is a a big architecture yes uh -huh. oh, okay. mm -hmm. hey hello teacher we already finished all the questions okay awesome i'm gonna put you on david's team Uh, 
um, a house. Mm -hmm. And also a car <laughs> because I don't I don't like travel by bus. <laughs> oh, <okay>. <laughs> and you? Okay. How many money? The friend. How many money? How many money or how much money? How's my money? Sorry. How much money? How much? Yes, how much money? No, 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 no. How many? I need it. One billion, one billion, two billion. Okay. No, we say how many dollars? See, how many dollars? Yes. But when you say money, we say how much yes, money? Yes, sorry, sorry. Yeah, how yeah. How many dollars? What? Ten million dollars. <laughs> Ten million dollars in your pockets right now, Erwin. What are you going to do? Surprise. I don't know. So much more. <laughs> Is, for me, it's easy. No, 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 no. I said, I said 10 million dollars. That's what I said. 10 million in your pocket right now. I just want the back first. Because it's all necessary. Too necessary. But I will figure out how many tax I will pay because I need the money. I will think. I will think about smart man, smart man, taxes very important. After that, um, look at what I happened to Tyson. Tyson had three hundred million, and he flushed it down the toilet. Yes, but I will think in one week to study what we do. I need to study one week for to know what we do. What I will do. I can I can give the answer in, in so in, in a real time because it's, it's too necessary to say what would you do in the future? Because it's so much money. So much money. You can uh, invest you can in Bitcoin. No, teacher. No, never. Never. <laughs> never. <laughs> Why? Uh, Why? <laughs> um, so, this, uh, uh, Bitcoin, in the last year, is a good business. But in that year, it's a bad business. In that year, uh, the electronic, the, the, the Bitcoin and similar. Do, do, do you remember that the, the, last, the last news about mm -hmm. the, the other electronic uh, mm -hmm. crypto cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They lose the money. Mm -hmm. Any person lose the money. Because yeah. The last year is a it's a good business. The last year, but at that moment we don't have it. Okay, okay. So what are you going to do with ten million I can, dollars? I can, give, I can give the answer because with so much money, I need to think. I will it. do what Donald Trump did. I would buy lots. In La Costa del Sol, lots in El Tunco, lots in La Union, hotel in Belize, Bitcoin City hotels. No, 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 I didn't do it. I, I, I won't do it. Maybe if I want to be sure, I will spend the money in Miami. I am maybe Boca maybe. Raton, I, Boca yeah, Raton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but I need to buy with the low price. 
South Florida. South Florida. Yeah. With the low price, it's the one person with the money. I will buy. It. I need oh, to think. Or maybe one week. Or maybe Palm Springs. Yes, it's, for me, it's, it's Miami, Florida, always okay. Yeah, because uh, the two Fort is, Lauderdale. Yeah, yeah real yeah. estate. Yeah, but I think that I will. Uh, this is so much money, ten minutes. But for the United States, also much. You got it. You got it. You got it. For you, it's natural, easy money. Yeah, I think that I will buy a hotel in Miami. Yeah, maybe it can be ten dollars, ten million. It's crazy, but what hotel in Miami? Uh, two or three. No, I will buy. Four apartment in Miami. Okay, teacher. Ah, this is ah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, I will buy two or three apartments. Uh, and I will rent. Uh, okay. After that, ten years, I will sell. Okay. Oh, oh, oh okay. Only and, that. And then move to New York and buy property in New York with the profit from the investment in Florida. And triple like, your money. I don't like it in New York because it's so cool. No, 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 not to live for investment oh, yeah, yeah. properties. Yeah, but I don't like it because I don't want to. Three like apartments it. in Madison Square Garden, New York oh, City. Wow. It's so much money. Yes, no, but I like Florida. New York, I don't, I don't like it. Hey, I'm going to be quiet so you can speak with Madeline. Sorry, Madeline. I am a little nosy. Don't worry, teacher. I like you. Listen. You say, uh, these guys are crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> What's funny? <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. I know I am not a normal guy. <laughs> continue, continue. It's better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, another question, Erwin. <clears throat> if you could be a celebrity for a day, which celebrity would you be? Don't say Johnny Depp. <laughs> your, your microphone is in silence, Erwin. We can't hear you. I think he <laughs> said Arnold. I think he said the Terminator. I can't remember. Yes, but I don't know. Uh, what will you do? Uh... Adele, <laughs> I like his voice, her voice. And you? She didn't. Yes, she was before in that in that way. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. Uh, you another, have another question. The power. Yeah, we already asked that. If we could change one thing, I I, I don't like that question. If you. All right, all right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Let me have one volunteer, one volunteer. Let me have just one volunteer, one volunteer. One volunteer, one volunteer. Let me have one volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer, please. One volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer. Only one, only one. Doris Elizabeth. 
Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Thank you for volunteering. Thank you. Thank you. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. I'm fine. Awesome. I like the painting on the wall. It looks nice. Fine. Thank you. Doris, please select somebody. Um, uh, uh, William. William. William Alexander Ramirez. Hello, William. How do you feel today? Hi, good evening, teacher. I feel great. Thanks for asking. Awesome. Awesome. I'm happy to see that you are recovering your health. That's great news. Yeah. All right. William and Doris are going to ask three questions. Doris, you are going to ask three questions and William will respond. You select the questions and then William, you're going to ask Doris three questions and Doris will respond. William, you select the questions. Are you ready? If, if Action! You had, if you had one wish, what would, what would it be? Mm, one wish. Maybe... <clears throat> uh, visited my my friends and my family in another country. Oh, yes. yeah. yeah. If, if you could have any superpower, what could you pick up and why? Mm, it could be fly, because you can uh travel fast around the world and visit some place uh, yeah you can do a lot of things faster ah, okay. if you could change on on if you could change one thing about yourself what would it be uh it could be well, well, yeah. My anxiety. Why do you feel that you have anxiety? <laughs> I don't know because I, I'm always stressful. Do you try to exercise or maybe, yeah. okay, meditate or mm -hmm. relaxing music and a lot of things? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pray, yeah. pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It helps a lot. It helps me. When I feel that way, I, you know, I turn off everything and I get in my bed and I, and I say, you know, because my family, when I was a little boy in the United States, uh, my grandmother, uh, she was very, very uh, a spiritual person, very religious, you know, every Sunday, Saturday, go to church, Wednesday, go to church. So, you know, now as an adult, uh, in when I feel this way, I pray, you know, I, I pray and I stay there praying until I feel <sighs> calm down. And then I continue working, you know, because I have a lot of stress. I have three jobs. Oh, my God. Yeah, I have three jobs. So you just imagine the, the density of the stress level that I, I control every day. And I have yeah. a lot of people. I have uh, my students. I have people that work for me. I have people that I am mentoring or my other team, the acquisitions manager team that I have to supervise. So it's like, you know, when you have a lot of people that are looking for you, wanting to talk to you, asking you this, they need help with that. 
then then you got the family issues and then you have my, i have two boys so just imagine the drama of two boys and then i have two baby mamas so imagine the drama of two baby mamas so i mean all of this is a lot of stress so yeah, uh, yeah for me I, i i like to exercise uh lift weights or go jogging this helps me a lot uh, i also like to read but i like to read material like natural nutrition that type mm -hmm. of material uh baby pass me the book pass me my book uh, la cura para todas las that one right there the pink one uh, i bought a very good book i love reading this book it's in english i i really don't read in spanish because my reading skills in spanish is not so good Uh, but right now I'm reading this book. It's in Spanish. It says, La cura para todas las enfermedades. The cure for all diseases. It's in English. It's in English. The cure for all diseases. Uh, so this is like a super awesome book because it gives you natural medicines for everything. You know, fruits, vegetables, herbs. I mean, it's it's incredible this is this for me this is an incredible book mm -hmm. okay continue sorry sorry <laughs> okay teacher i don't have the questions i sent the questions to the whatsapp group are you in the whatsapp group ah, okay uh-huh Let me meet. Check. Should be right there. Okay. Okay, Doris. Um, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? Well, I I would like to. Turkia. I uh, we say Turkey. 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 I would like to go to Turkey because it's a beautiful country in the, the there are um, uh, many places for visited. In many places or many places. Many places. For visit for, or to visit? For visit. To or, visit. To visit. To visit. Uh -huh. There are mm -hmm. many places to visit. Uh -huh. There are many places to visit. Mm -hmm. Okay, next question. If you could pack only three items for your next trip, what would they be? Um... I pack a, a gift, gift for my grandson and my daughter and my... No, 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 no. The question is not what you're going to buy when you go to Turkey. The question is, what would you put in your bag in your house to go? To Turkey, what would you uh, put in your luggage? It, uh, I, um, clothes, in gift, gift, a uh, gift for my family. And, mm -hmm. and, oh, you have family in Turkey. No, I I I I have family in Germany. Oh, but, nice, but nice. Uh, uh, I I told uh, my daughter uh, I would like to visit Turkey, and she told me Turkey, uh, Turkey, Turkey. She have Turkey, and she told me the next. To, the next to travel to Germany, the baby, uh, we are visit Turkey. 
is in beep. For that, I, I always visit uh, my daughter and my grandson in Germany. I, I, I carry on, I don't know if it's correct, carry on many gifts for them. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the next question is if you could change the past, would you do it? In the past, eh, um, I have uh, the only change in the past is uh, uh, I have a, a no lose, no lose the, the change for for is for a uh, uh, chance opportunity for a chance a uh, I don't know what to say superación or, or no chances I no lose the opportunity for job in a big uh, company yes only. Thanks, Doris. All right, thank you. excellent. Good job, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, guys, now I gotta take the attendance. Please say present if you are present, absent if you are absent. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Let me see. The first one is Axel. Present. Present. Andres Giovanni. Present, teacher. Good. Blanca. Present. Good. David. Present, teacher. Excellent. Dora. Present. Good job. Erwin. Very good. Fatima. Present. Awesome. Fernando. Present. Fantastic. Francisco. Present teacher. Good job. Freddy's. I'm here, teacher. Excellent. Jarving. Present teacher. Great. Kenya. Present. Awesome. Madeline. Present. Good work. Manuel de Jesus. Present. All right. Marlon. Marlon Stanley. is absent, okay. Thelma. Thelma. Okay, Thelma. Um, William Alexander. Present. Good job, William. Jessica. I'm here. Good. And Jocelyn. Present teacher. Awesome, awesome. Okay, good attendance, good attendance. All right, now guys, what we're going to do is move forward and I'm going to send you a question, questions related to have you ever, what context is have you ever? What is the context? In what situation do I use have you ever? Who can tell me? When do I use have you ever? It is like a experience that we have previously on the past. Have you ever, for example, have you ever been on Africa? Mm. Like experiences that correct. we already have. Yes, yes, that is correct. 
we use have you ever whenever we want to express something that happened to us in the past, but not at a specific time, right? For example, if I say to you, have you ever watched Titanic, right? And you say, yes, I have. Did you give me a specific time when you watched Titanic in the past? No, 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 you didn't. If I ask you, when did you watch Titanic? Oh, I watched it last Friday. Oh, that's simple past. Why? Because you're giving me a specific time. What is the specific time? What is the specific time? Last Friday. Last so, Friday, yes. Last Friday. So basically, uh, Mr. Santos, in what situation is important for me to use the present perfect? Have you ever? Why? What, what is the objective? What, why should I use the present perfect? All right. The present perfect. Is that your question? Is that your question, David? Yes, yes. Is present <laughs> perfect or, or past perfect? Present perfect. Present perfect. Present perfect. Okay. okay. Thank you. So if, you're, if you are, for example, imagine that you are in a meeting or you are in a training or you are in a public place and you meet somebody. Hey, what's your name? Oh, my name is Ruben. Hey, nice to meet you. Where are you from? Oh, I'm from Houston, Texas. What about you? Oh, I'm from South Florida. Awesome. I love South Florida. Have you ever visited Houston? Alguna vez has visitado Houston? Oh, yes, I have. As a matter of fact, I went to the Selena concert back in 1990. Really? I was there too. Oh, that's great. I love her music. Me too. Right. And what happens? You are breaking the ice. You are breaking the ice. Okay, let's practice. Give me one volunteer. One volunteer. Give me one volunteer. One volunteer. Me too, Jim. Uh, David, we're going to give somebody else a chance. Guys, somebody else that wants to participate? Let me see. Me too, Jim. Okay, okay. Go ahead. I will ask you a question, right? No, 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 no. We're going to start like if we're at a party. Or if we oh, are, my God. or like if we are, <laughs> yeah, like if we are, I shared the questions in the WhatsApp group. Yeah, did, yeah, did, yeah. Did everybody get them? Okay. So basically, we're going to imagine that we are at a party, uh, at a conference, and I meet you. Okay? Okay. Hey. I will try. Okay. Say, so, hey, how you doing? Hi, I'm great. And you? Awesome. What's your name? My name is Blanca. Hey, nice. Uh, I just came from here. Okay. What's your name? Oh, my name is Santos. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you too. Where are you from? Mm -hmm. I'm from Apopa. <laughs> oh, from that's... Apopa. That's... I don't know what I'm doing here, but, but I'm from Apopa. <laughs> that's so cool have you ever traveled out of your home country to another country uh, yes i already traveled to guatemala oh really i've never been I, to guatemala how is it really yeah well it, it was great i i stayed uh, about four days in there and it was uh, a great experience because really? I met some beautiful places. That's so good. I've heard so many nice things about uh, Guatemala. Um, I know that they have uh, Indian ruins. Have you ever visited the ruins? No, I don't. No, I don't. I oh, no, I haven't. I haven't. Uh huh. No, I haven't because it's present perfect. So basically, okay. guys, the, this structure, have you ever, or thank you, Blanca. Everybody applause for Blanca for her participation. Thank you. 
So basically, guys, the this structure, have you ever, is normally used whenever you want to uh, break the ice uh, when you meet somebody. Okay, it's a very good way for you to break the ice with somebody new that you just met, right? You say, hey, how you doing? What's your name? Oh, my name is Mario. What about you? Oh, I'm Ruben. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Where are you from? Oh, I'm from Houston. And you? Yeah, me too. What part? Oh, okay, cool. Have you ever been to Astro World? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I have, right? And boom, you start the conversation. One question leads to another question. Another question leads to another question. And before you know it, you are friends. You have things in common. You share similar ideas. You have experienced similar things. You have been to similar places. Now you're BFFs. Any questions? Questions, questions? No. All right. We are going to ask and respond the questions. Let's go. Hello, where are we? Hi, Hello, good evening, guys. Good evening. How are you? Fine, I'm fine. Hmm. Well, um, the teacher sent us the mini question, no? Yes. Okay. <coughs> Me ha costado you, conectarme, perdón. Don't worry. Your internet. Eh, tengo problemas, sí. Tengo algunos problemas. Okay. But eh, I watched the WhatsApp and <laughs> and I, okay. I okay. make some some answer. For I'm example, uh, I wish, yeah. Let me begin, guys. Did you listen? Yes. No. Okay. Yes. Have you ever traveled out of your home country? Okay. Tell me. Can you tell me? Have you ever traveled, traveled out of your home country? Let me see. I look. Uh, I check my WhatsApp. Okay. The first. Okay. I have you ever traveled? Yes. Have you ever traveled this? out of your home country? Yo estaba traba, yo estaba trabajando en las otras preguntas. No. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yes. I yes. Ask, uh, tell me. The either is like similar sometimes. Sometimes is many times. Either is only one time. You remember? Yes. Okay. Continue. Have you ever traveled out of your home country? Uh, yes, I traveled to Mexico. Uh, your home country is, uh, excuse me. 
fuera de, de tu... And so, Nicaragua, Guatemala, Honduras, Mexico. Oh. Um, I don't know. That's all. Okay. And, and you were going to Me. Did you ever travel? Oops. The real answer is I sometimes travel out of my country, of my home country. I sometimes. Because either, either is una sola vez, sometimes is algunas veces. Y always es siempre. Pero yo lo interpreto alguna vez. Eh, alguna vez has viajado fuera de tu has país. Has viajado fuera de tu país. Yes. Entonces, yes. I, pero como has viajado varias veces, I, I travel on uh, sometimes. Esto se refiere a solo una vez. Oh, y either es una vez. Por ejemplo, yo vi una vez Titanic, por ejemplo. No lo vi varias veces. No, no, espérate, espérate. Ya te dejé hablar, ya te dejé hablar. Está sometimes, está either y always. Either is one time. Always is. And then, uh, what is could be the answer? Yeah, if you if you uh, visit many countries, you can say, "Oops, I sometimes visit other country." I do not visit other country. Okay. Um. Okay. 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 What is the, what is your answer, Madly? Well, in my case, I have never traveled to another country and I will like one day. Oh, okay. But at the moment, no. Okay. What is the next question? Next <laughs> is... I have one. Uh, have you have you ever wanted to get a tattoo or piercing? <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> really? When I, and you when I watch it, when when I was watching the film called uh purple purple blood. Oh, the purple yeah. blood. Uh, I don't know. It's a, it's a short story about the um, uh, a color a, a color woman <laughs> uh, oh. a black woman. Oh, I don't know. I didn't watch that movie. <laughs> The film. <laughs> and you are. Yes. Uh huh. Okay. Continue with them. Never. Me, never. Oh. In yes, my case. I, 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 cry. I was crying. Okay. And you? Uh, I mean, I piercing, but. Um, I am afraid with the, the pain. <laughs> <laughs> and the other. And you, Erwin? Uh, for me, never. <laughs> Have you ever won a trophy? If if yes, which competition did you win? Someone? 
please. Have you ever won a trophy? If yes, which competition did you win? Have you ever won a trophy? Yes, trofeo. Yeah, yeah. In my case, never. <laughs> well, mm -hmm. in, uh, in secondary, uh, for be the fair, the for be a good uh, student, I get the one, mm -hmm. the first uh, trophy. Mm -hmm. And play soccer. As a group, we we won a trophy. And Thelma, Erwin? Mm, I don't remember, Madeline. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> 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 Sorry. If... Well, uh, I play many, many sports, but <laughs> I never won anything. <laughs> <laughs> I played basketball, uh, I ride a bike. Um, how do you say, how do you say salto alto? I don't know. Nothing. Nothing. I jump. I jump. Is a uh, in a I jump. Yes, alto. Yeah, or jump. Yes. Are you an athletic woman? Did you wear athletic? And um, I remember that uh, I I ride in a horse without. What do you say? Sin montura? I don't know. Okay. Uh, saddle, saddle. Without saddle. Eh, montar caballos sin montura. <laughs> and in uh, in Metapan City, uh, in the, I don't remember, Fiesta Patronal. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Um, I practice, uh, I, I played a competition in, in ride, and riding a horse without saddle. <laughs> I, I was a crazy woman. <laughs> and now? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Actually, I'm a serious woman. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Well, in Madeline and Erwin, uh, I don't remember. Do you never? Do you never wanna a, a trophy? I don't. I don't, remember. I don't remember. I answered that that question yes. before. Well. And have you ever created a book that changed your life? I never. And me, the Bible. Thank <laughs> 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 you so much. 
Guys. I don't understand it, sí. the, the, the question. Guys, guys, yeah. I will restart my computer. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, no problem. Have you ever read a book? That could change your life. Changes, change your I don't mind. understand the, the question. Que si has leído alguna vez eh, un libro que haya cambiado tu vida. Ah, oh, right. No really. <laughs> no really. Um, I remember that I read I read a, a book written by um, Coelho. Uh -huh. What is the name of the book? Uh, is a uh, is about a man that uh, I don't remember. Well, the question is uh, is the is a man that uh, travel get a loser. Okay. Oh my God. Yes, I mean. And have you ever fallen in love? Yes. Many times. <laughs> Many times? <laughs> no, no, no. I can't believe it. Yes, I, I, I was in love when I was uh, when I was I a teenager. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. I, I I remember this because I ah, I remember that the teacher Silvia said that the about the uh, uh, scar. Uh, uh, scar. Mm -hmm. In fact, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> in your memory, in my legs, right? in my legs, in my in my arms, <laughs> in your mind. And um, no, no, really. And my, my um, basically is in my in my arms and my legs. So, mm -hmm. uh, raspone, etc. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hello, Marlon. Hello. Oh. Huh. Good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Good night. What are you um, talking about? Um, in this moment, we are going to change the the question. Um, okay. Have you ever had a dream that felt like it was real? Have if I have ever had a dream that comes true that was um, no no I never I never had a dream that comes true um, I don't, let me remember thinking about that no I never had a dream that comes true mm -hmm. and you tell me um yeah um <laughs> well, <laughs> tell me a while about that <laughs> one time I, I felt that i i i took i i taken a shower <laughs> right and yes i felt it the the water <laughs> and <laughs> but the real re, the real was is my mother <laughs> okay 
<laughs> for that, uh, uh, for that, I felt that it was real. It was so real, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you only. Mm, only I, I, I've woken up the uh, with tears because. I don't know. I I don't remember the I didn't remember the dream, but uh, I I think that was uh, sad because mm -hmm. I woken I woken with tears in my in my face. I don't know why. <laughs> Only that. And you have a a ring that you um, that you uh, you were walking in a road and suddenly uh, there is a there is a step and you and you fall yes yeah oh, oh. <laughs> me too <laughs> <laughs> yes okay well, and guys, how you have you ever fallen in love? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right now. Uh, <laughs> really? <Ooh. Yeah. laughs> and you said? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Are you married? But no, no, actually, and divorced. Um, but uh, I feel love for the man. <laughs> but uh, the uh -huh. thing changed. <laughs> ah, you have another right now. No, right now, no. Another time. Ah, okay. <laughs> but the love is beautiful. Yes. Pain. Oh. In in and but. Marlon. Yes, I'm sorry. Um, if I ever fell in love, yes, of course. Um. Um. Now, now, I don't have someone to love right now, but. Probably in the future, <laughs> but um, yes, I I was in love uh, in two times I think. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yeah. Good. Okay. <clears throat> Have you ever louder? So much, so much that it made you cry. Loud, loud. Creo que es la pronunciación. Loud. Love I don't know. Love it. Have you ever laughed? So yes, much? yes. <laughs> <laughs> many times, many times. Okay. When I. I hear a joke um, on the work in, in, in my work. Um, Did with your family, with your friends. Yes. Mm -hmm. With my uh, boyfriend. <laughs> no, with my my friends. Oh. Yes. They makes me cry <laughs> for the joke. <laughs> and you, Marlo? Yeah, this someone makes me cry. Uh, yeah, my mom. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, yes, yes, probably my grandmother. 
and she got sick. I was really sad and yes, of course I cried for that's it, it, what is the question? It's about someone make you cry, right? No, but no, eh. it's, it's love it, reído. Alguna vez has reído mucho que te hizo sen, eh, te ah, hizo llorar. Sure, love? Yes, ah, love ah, someone make me laugh that I cry, that make me, uh, I laugh a lot that make me cry. Yes, probably uh, my friends. I, I guess my friends in the university, at university, they are really funny sometimes when they are saying, they are telling some jokes. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh, or when they are talking about. Uh, and when I fell. <laughs> Also, or when you make some, or when you do something stupid, <laughs> or yeah. when you fall down, you are walking and you fall down on the street, and yeah. <laughs> or something yeah. funny, <laughs> yeah. Uh, how sometimes you go in the public transportation and they go fast and they suddenly stop, and so that you can fall. <laughs> In the middle of the bus. Oh my goodness, that's terrible. <laughs> oh, when sometimes you make something bad in your job, a Nero, and you do a Nero in your job, make a Nero. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, in that case, if I do something wrong, probably I'm gonna cry, but because <laughs> my boss is gonna say something about the bad decision and about the bad, I don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. Of course, and, and, and more if you work in a call center. Uh, oh, that is a stressful job. That's, you have a lot of stress if you work in a call center. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even, even, even cruel jokes make you laugh. <laughs> Yeah, with with our friends. I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, um. Okay. I I said that the even even cruel jokes makes me you makes makes you laugh. Yeah. Sé que hasta los chistes más crueles te hacen reír. <laughs> uh, but with your friends <laughs> yeah of course uh -huh. yeah of course my friends from the university they are terrible <laughs> oh, my. I, I remember the stupid things that they say <laughs> I, will, I will be uh, laughing all day long <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. or, so, or you remember something funny in the past and you go yes. in the bus and you are laughing <laughs> You are alone and you are laughing. <laughs> yeah, uh -huh. that happened with me also. Mm -hmm. And you, girls, uh, t where do you work, Thelma and Madeline? My work? Yeah, where do you work? In Optica La Joya. Ah, good. And yeah. you, Madeline? It's in the I'm sorry? Gestionadora de créditos. Oh, hey, I need a, a, a credit. <laughs> <laughs> <Have> us. <laughs> no, no, really. <laughs> from a bank or a, Yes, a we have credit cards that they, that they didn't pay. When people don't, when when they don't pay the the, the call to the house. okay, and then to the hack that this laya to the hack this part, the train you are in goes to the hack, and the other part that is uh, 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 starting to travel now, this part is going to Yarbur, the place you go. You need to run and to go because uh, you were lost. I, I have no no money. The, the ticket for the train was so expensive. You need to to 
uh, about 30 euros for a for a, a a travel in the train is so expensive the the travel in the train and uh, i need to go to the part that i was in get my bag run to the other part and okay. i was on time it was a, a very the de, 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 de experience because I, I didn't understand the the, the message and, and this scene it don't happen so so often. Okay. But uh, I can I can get to the place I was going in, but it's it's, it's a disturbing situation. Oh, yes, I can imagine that. <laughs> Okay. What about you, Fernando? Had you ever been lost? Uh, well, uh, when I, I am driving, when, uh, for example, for example, I, I don't know a place, I used to use ways. <laughs> I used to use <laughs> way because uh, it's, 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 it's very easy to use. Um, uh, for me, you, not. Using using that, uh, uh, thank thank God I, I don't had to uh, a bad experience that to 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 tell us <laughs> tell yours um, and no I, I I always for example when I I know that for example tomorrow I have to go to a, a place that I, I don't know where it is uh, I. I consult Google Maps. I I try to to figure out uh, what 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 is it, what is the place and where it is and how what uh, for example what uh, stores or a, a reference reference point yes for to avoid to avoid that, that experience <laughs> yes and I I prepare myself after <laughs> after going. When I, I don't know where is the the place, where is the place? <laughs> okay. Yes, but but why sometimes sometimes may may some routes that uh, uh, I remember once uh, that uh, we are uh, returning from the from the La Costa del Sol and uh, activate wise because the I love La Costa del Sol. Yes, it was very, very good beaches, but uh, they was uh, made some reparations in the street, maybe, and, uh, and uh, there was no signals. It was uh, at night, and uh, the guys guide us to uh, for all of the all of the place that it is La Cordillera del Balsamo. In a very very dark street, a very very uh, I don't know how to say that is uh, up, up and up and up, and uh, then uh, we were to we arrived to Hayake, in oh. uh, in. Uh, then to the street of uh, Sonsonate to <laughs> la, la, but it was a, a, a very big turn uh, following wise maybe maybe was the best route because that is the wise do the base route but uh, in the night and without lights and uh, uh, was a, a shocking experience with using wise <laughs> another okay. one the last one have time with for another one or the time is over not yet okay we have another one get you All right, we still have 10 more minutes. Let me have Fernando and David. 
Fernando ask David three questions, David respond, and David ask Fernando three questions, and Fernando respond. Okay. Okay. Go ahead, Fernando. Uh, have you ever laughed so much that that it made you cry? Oh yes, yes. I like to laugh, and I many times laugh until crying, until tears. Uh, I I think I am very very. Uh, I don't know if happy, but. I I like to to laugh and I like to have a good mood in my life. Okay. Your turn. Another one. Your turn. One and one. Okay, one on one. Okay, it's excellent. Have you ever experienced cultural shock? Uh cultural shock. Uh, I don't I don't sure what is the main of that that expression, cultural shock. Uh, that is like, for example, imagine that you travel to China. Okay. Uh, China is a new culture, new food, new lifestyle, new currency, new places, new language, new smells, new sounds, new tastes, new everything. And you're like, uh, do you have any pupusas, guys? Ah. Right, you're like lost. You, I mean, you're like, it's a ah, okay. shock. Okay. You're like, whoa, hold on, is this another planet? Okay, what's what's going on right here? Yes, uh, for example, well, I, I I like to to watch some videos for from some YouTubers like Lucito. I I I, I watch a, a a video when he was um. Uh, I don't know what is the what is the country about is in Asia, Asia and in that in that country he, he show uh, some food that I I can imagine how that people eat that it's... food for example worms and cockroach and oh they uh, they <laughs> they eat every every uh, insect animal that exists in the world and I don't know how how they can eat that and I I only I I only see that and I feel like a, oh that is horrible <laughs> maybe like maybe that is uh, the, the most <laughs> the most shark culture that I have with the food because I I, I know uh, you can watch different cultures and uh, you can watch uh, how uh, what is the behavior in different countries the, the what just they used to do every day then it's very different than us because uh, it, that they are in, in a different uh, different countries different land and or in different places all is different okay interesting in my case, in, in, in my case, once I, I was talking with a, a, a Chilean guys, uh, we are near to the sea. And, and this guy uh, asked me if we, if I would to, to go to the beach, we are about uh, five minutes to the beach, walking is very, very near. And I, I told them, yes, I, I, I want to go. But uh, let me go for my, uh, we says in, in, in Spanish, for my calzoneta. Calzoneta, okay. All of us know about what is a calzoneta. It's a soon sweet. But uh, these guys, the Chilean guys, uh, was laughing, laughing and laughing. And, you are going for what? And I, I told that uh, <laughs> there are something bad, but they, they told me that in, in their country, in Chile, the, they said calzoneta to the uh, underwear clothes for women. And uh, 
And for that reason, they, they were laughing about me. Uh, that, 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 that kind of thing that uh, very difficult, but uh, okay. <laughs> Another question, Fernando. Okay, in my, in my turn. Had you ever seen something supernatural or paranormal? Yes, yes, I I I seen something uh, supernatural, paranormal in in my own life. I I had an an, an accident, a very very bad accident. I was uh, injured. I was carried to the uh, UCI, the, the in intensive care unit in the hospital. And uh, the diagnosis was, I was broken, my, my, my head broken. And uh, the, the doctors, uh, Take some many many radiographies of my head, and there was a, a rupture. I don't know how to say. I was, I was uh, broken, broken. My head was broken, but two hours later, there was nothing. Nothing was. My my head was uh, healed miraculously. It was a miracle, and they went with me. All of the seven doctors in the hospital went go with me to the to the surgery room to the to the uh, uh, how do you say rayos X X rays take, X rays X rays yeah. And they take another X rays another X rays. And they show the boss, one with the broken head and the, the other with without nothing. But but the 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 head the the head was healed, but uh, the face was like a monster. Uh, all of the all of the head was uh, uh, inflamado, swollen. Sorry, sorry. Swollen. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Uh, 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 Swollen. Yes, in, in my my eyes purple. I, I was like uh, Mr. Incredible, with all my eyes uh, purple, black, but uh, the the head was healed by by a miracle. This was important thing, but that does not the that's that's not the supernatural. The supernatural was what uh, me and while I, I I was in the in the hospital, I can eat because I don't have uh, the 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 ability to to show to to I, I can eat, and uh, there was a, a old woman, a very old woman that uh, all the afternoon went to the hospital with a special food, like uh, like. Uh, yeah, I don't know, gelatina, jelly, jelly, jelly okay, jelly, like jelly. The the girl, the the this old woman gave me, gave me, gave okay. me the the food, and uh, a week a week after, I asked to to the to the nurse, who is the woman who who bring me food, and the nurse say me. There are no us. Nobody can can bring food to the hospital. It, it, it's prohibited. Nobody. I don't know why, but I, I I can eat the 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 food of the hospital. They give me food because I was normal. It's supposed that I was normal. They give me food, but I can eat that that food. And was that food that old lady gave me that maintained me. Wow. Uh, in that time, this was a very, very special. It's a very big miracle in my life. It was something supernatural. Wow. Wow. Very interesting. Incredible. How long ago was that? 
how how many years ago? Uh -huh. I, I was uh, 17 years. It's about uh, it was in 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 1979. 1979. Wow. Yes. Okay. Wow. Very interesting. Very interesting. Amazing. All right. I, I was I was sorry sorry the last thing. Uh -huh. uh -huh. I was in the newspaper like that. What? My name is was there. Yes. And do you remember anything about what you saw in the afterlife? Do you recall I, 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 any any light? Did you see a light? Did you speak no, with I, an I, angel? I, I, what I mean, what do you remember from from what you what from this experience? Or I, was it like I, you, I did you, it. you were just black and then light? Or or what 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 yes, yes. I, I, I didn't see nothing. I, I was like uh, like uh uh, a, a Christmas light. I was in, out, in, out. I I listened some part of the dialogue of the of the medicals, and then out, like sleep, and then I wake up for another time, and they out, but uh, nothing in the in the meantime, nothing, nothing, all all black, unconscious. Yes, unconscious, totally unconscious. Yes. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. That's incredible. I'm going to feel, I'm going to say thank you, Jesus, that miracles yes. still exist tonight. Yes, yes, are, yes. Yeah, okay. Applause for David and Fernando, guys. <laughs> that's incredible. Hey, thank you for sharing. Thank you for sharing. All right, we're going to stop right here, guys. Uh, we're going to work with Francisco. It's your turn to stay. Everybody else, we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Thank okay, you. Okay, good night. Good, good night, class. everybody. Good class. Bye. Good class. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. So we're going to stay with Francisco. Francisco, can you hear me? Yeah, teacher. All right. We're going to look at the questions. Do you have the questions in front of you? Okay. Okay. About what? We're going to look at these questions over here. Have you ever traveled out yeah. of your home country? Mm, yes. I was traveling to Costa Rica and Honduras. Oh, Costa Rica mm -hmm. and Honduras. Tell me about Costa Rica. Wow, well, Costa Rica is beautiful. I like it, his culture because during the travel or trip, mm -hmm. I never see a crash bat in the, in the whatever place, in the street, mm -hmm. in the supermarket, in the beach, never. Mm -hmm. um, the highways, the 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 kind of, of, of highway is very interesting because when, uh, how do you say pendiente? Pending. When when you take the handing is mm -hmm. is the double carril. No sé si así se dice doble carril. Uh, no, double carril is double lane. Double, double lane. D O U. -E oh, okay. D O U B L E. Mm -hmm. Double lane. Double lane. Uh, only in a specific part. Mm -hmm. However, if the. Mm, la pendiente es invertida, o sea, uno viene bajando. Oh, inverted. It's inverted. It is inverted. Mm -hmm. Inverted. Inverted. It's only one line. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. And obviously, it's a good highway. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, obviously, the the environment or environment. Environment. Uh huh. Uh huh. The environment is a very very good i i was visiting the punta leona okay 
ang ang Manta Beach. Oh, nice. Wow, it's a beautiful, beautiful place. Wow, and what kind of food are is there? Ah, I like it, the chifrido. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Chifrido is to rice and beans mm -hmm. with pico de gallo. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, chicharrones. Oh, I love chicharrones. You are talking my language. <laughs> okay, the avocado. Oh, I love the, avocados. Uh, avocado, um, cuajada. Mm, nice, nice. And what about the fashion? What's their style, their clothes, fashion? The fashion? Sorry, I, I don't know you understand it. What is the question? Oh, for example, their, the subistuario, for example, in El Salvador, it's yeah, the, the it's, typical uh-huh is similar like El Salvador. Oh, okay. Yeah. And what However, about the what about the uh -huh. nightlife? Um is is other words mm. because you can you can walk in whatever street mm -hmm. or whatever place is is a very short mm -hmm. safe very safe yes um we was visiting the, the Haco beach mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The we night. was or we were we were uh -huh. we were visiting the the Haco beach mm -hmm. wow it's a beautiful place is it's like to in, in in this place live some person like to person uh, como de reggae, no sé cómo decirlo. ¿Cómo de, de, como de qué? Como de la cultura reggae, like cultural. Oh, reggae, reggae. Reggae, reggae culture. Reggae, reggae culture. Uh -huh. But the, the surfing is, is the, um, the sport number one in this place. Really nice. Yeah. It was. We was visiting uh, the Arenas Negras. Mm. Uh, in this place is uh, is very popular for the for the surf mm -hmm, mm -hmm. because uh, the international person. Mm -hmm. Like to visit this place because the um, European the CEO, Europeans the, the European person uh -huh. um como se dice por el tipo de olas for kind of because of because of the type of wave the type of wave because of the type of waves because of the type of wave ah uh, is very very beautiful the the most the most important that i can see costa rica was the um, guacamayos what is that? Guacamayos. The birds, guacamayos. It's, it's, it's like the, the animal that, that say the, the slogan to Taka. Oh. <laughs> and do you have any plans to go back anytime soon? Yes, if I have opportunities, I like it. <laughs> go again. <laughs> What would you do different this time that you didn't do the first time? What would you change, plan? What would you do different? When I, when I can go to the Costa Rica, or no? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, what, what would you do different if you had the opportunity to go back? Uh, maybe visit the other place. What place? I would, I would like to visit the mountain. Argentina? 
Yeah. Chile? Uh, I would like to visit um, Argentina. Ecuador? No, I, no. Ecuador, no. Brazil? Mm, no, I prefer maybe to visit the Colombia, maybe. Oh, why? Mm, I don't know. I, I would like to, to, to test the arepas. What is that? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I, it's supposed to be very famous. Uh, fa famous. 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 Oh, cool. Like to pupusas in El Salvador. Oh, arepas, really? Or no? I don't know. I've never tasted it. Um, mm -hmm. I see in some documental that the arepas is a um, is a egg number one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right, uh, Francisco, we're going to go ahead and yeah. stop right here and we'll get okay. back on it tomorrow. You have a good okay. night and thank you so much. Bye-bye. Thank, thank you, you, teacher. Thank you.